The farmers must be weary of the island neighbor. Perhaps they will help us. Alrighty, folks. So this is uh, the mission that I probably fumbled the most during my original playthrough of this game. So this for me is more of a story arc of redemption to uh, not only just win this mission, but destroy Red. So first things first, I'm going to grab a Monra, put her on a separate pot key. Team 1 can go down here, grab a Relic that's just up here that's pretty useful. Increases my unit cap or pop cap. So we're going to want to avoid picking up all the houses and the reason being the houses if we build all of our houses before we start capturing houses we can actually enhance our population limit which is going to be super useful for this particular mission because it is a challenging one There's a uh, temple down here that we want to pick up and avoid both of these houses. Things should be just here. There's another relic here we can pick up. There's actually loads of relics dotted around. I didn't realise just how many relics there were on this mission. Um, but it is super useful to know where they are and what they all do. Grab this one, we're going to grab this one. I'm actually just going to have these guys just scout around the map. There's also a bunch of things down here to take out. I'm going to grab the upgrades. This guy needs to build this. A couple of guys down here. We're going to want to build a um, secondary base as soon as we are able. Which is why we're racing down here so that we can literally insta-build TC. There's another relic here we can pick up. Which increases uh, building damage to myth units. These guys are finished, they'll be doing gold. Again, we are really just trying to avoid picking up any houses until we've uh, built our last house. And then we can overcap. We'll definitely be taking all of these villages. There's only actually one fishing boat we can take advantage of. This being built. These guys over here. You can grab the fish. Okay, so note we're at 99 bot, we can't build any more housing, we are at our limit in that regard, but if we keep building, taking these, now we can over pot and over cap. So that is what we're going to be doing next, we're going to be grabbing the guard towers too. house here so I'm just scouting all the housings things I need to pick up want to grab this as well bow now 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 I want to build a lot of monuments too So a dockyard here might not be a bad shout. We definitely need more. So this is also the location where the enemy will start uh, attacking us. We 
And they'll drop using Leviathan, so we need to make sure we've got an army to protect this lower village. Take these guys down here. So what we can do is we can pretty much hold this ground here. And that will defend the attacks against my main base. And we just have one base to defend, which is this one over here. I want to go on to uh, wood production at this point. I'm actually going to build a temple here. Stronghold over here too. Into you. Caillou, il refer. In so that's maxed out as far as relics go, but there are more to grab. So I'm going to grab a transport boat. There's some really good relics to pick up just over here. You follow this little river. There's like four more relics we can grab, and there's three on this island alone. There's one over here, which I don't think is that good. Like, it gives you um, villagers um, health regeneration, which is arguably not that good. It's unfortunate timing. Guys, that there. Stop for a second just so I can build up some actual. Upgrades. Take two on that one. We want to age up as soon as we're able. So as soon as that mid goal is built, we can uh, age up. Move these guys onto the gold there. Into you. In fact, we can uh, put a man on this. So these are actually transport boats in a way. Can body block. Open landing, never mind.
age up and I'm gonna go for Cyrus Send this guy down here. That was the upgrades. Mana right over here. Stop you villager production. We've got a really strong, robust eco at this point. Guys, they can deal with another base there. I'm gonna put another dock here. So, first things first, we need to control the water. We control the water, we take care of their docks and then the game becomes a lot easier for us to manage. Right, this is just not letting me unload. Let's, uh, let's try this a different way. There we go. There we go. Where's that going? Over here, presumably. We don't actually have a standing army. That could be a problem. Oh, he's coming to this base, I see. Into you. Uh. Wait, did a man drop a thing off? No. I'm not sure why this thing keeps defaulting back over here. I have to keep a close eye on this thing. Yeah, so it's not following my orders is the problem. It's easier if I use... Uh, I was going to say Leviathan, but I don't really have one right now. In 
Okay, now these are really massive uh, relics, so we'll go for village farm rate. But there's also uh, double damage for myth units on naval myth units, and heroes do more damage against myth units. There are considerable upgrades to. What I need is an armory to start these upgrades. Stop building that now. Down, 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 down. These can stop building ships. Luckily, I have mass supply and it is crazy. Yeah, it literally just does not follow my orders at all, which is very annoying. I'm gonna want a couple of turtles, and then I wanna grab these two as well on a station. God of Osiris, definitely nine, or son of Osiris even. Damn, this thing is infuriating. Just does not follow my orders ever. Oh, dear me. Right. I do actually kind of want to build a lighthouse because they're really, really good and they're pretty inexpensive as well. Right, last relic and then we are done with this stupid boat that refuses to listen to my orders. Point we can start our invasion. In a U -E -A -I -U. So this is myth unit heroes do more damage against myth units. U -E -A. We are gonna want to grab uh, some priests. Priests are incredible against myth units, and the enemy has a lot of them. At this point, we can start to uh, cut our invasion for real. Only worth us picking up. Um, Lighthouse here as well. Definitely take care of this and this. Oh, this one's actually got units in, so this is definitely our main target. This one doesn't have any troops in, but it's still definitely worth taking out. This one does. Just heading towards our land.
Once we collect control of the seas, we can uh, start taking control of the land. Got all the upgrades working on. I need this. We need hotkeys. Might not even be a bad snap to get a second one of these so that we can upgrade faster. Stop building priests at this point. Basically, you systematically going from left to right, or top to bottom, and the other one's going to go from bottom to top. So we should meet in somewhere in the middle, take care of all the stuff on the outskirts, and then we can deal with the enemy. So we don't get the best myth units in this mission, so actually myth units aren't really the uh, thing to be grabbing. Even though there's still some good myth units to grab, it's not really our focus. We don't need any more boats. We've uh, got max boats now. I'm well aware that at this point we could quite easily finish this mission, but the goal of this isn't to just complete the mission, it's to destroy Red. So because all of these, uh, most of their buildings are on the coast, it's very easy for us just to use ships to uh, conquer this mission. Or at least destroy all the important stuff anyway. Whatever survives we'll deal with with the uh, troops. Take care of that. That's a problem. At this point, we could probably rebuild a couple of boats. In fact, let's, uh, let's back out of that entirely. I want to be careful that we're not wasting our time destroying stuff that's irrelevant for us. The main goal of this is to take control of the, the, the sea, not the land. Let's 
It's one of those, like, just because you can do something doesn't necessarily mean you necessarily should. This is very much a case of we can kill their land army, but I don't... It's not really the goal of why I built all these units. Just to take control of the sea, so killing the docks is actually the goal of these units. Now, 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 now. Problem still. On this now. This should be the last dock. Enemy doesn't rebuild buildings in this mission. Actually, this is a is an Age of Empires thing I'm thinking of. I've never done it in Age of Mythology, we told to my knowledge. Okay, alright. Now we do need a couple of transport boats. There's a lot of troops. Let's uh, hold fire there. The upgrades are done. Into you, Gary. Into you, Gary. Into you. Into you. But you can load that many uh, elephants onto a uh, transport ship's kind of funny. Like Noah's Ark, but tiny. <laughs> Don't need these. Now we are in full control of this game. Into 
There's a man around. There she is. So we'll roll this onto that. That anymore. So this army can go north and deal with all of these. That's team three to deal with everything else. In fact, let me grab this. That's team one. That's team two. That's now team three. Serve their purpose if we can take care of these as well. There's only priests, I've got loads of them. Left the Manra. She jumped onto the objective, that's annoying. Oh well, it is what it is. They're pretty much dead anyway, to be fair. I have something I've been meaning to give you since you first ran from me at the temple, Kemset. I'd like nothing better than to drain your blood into the sand, Amanra. But I cannot waste time with you now. <laughs> <laughs> Coward. Your time will come, Amanra. Soon. Soon. Alrighty, folks, that'll right about do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. If this is the kind of content you enjoy, then please do consider subscribing to the channel. It does help support the channel and would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. I feel like I've redeemed myself with this mission. Um, I think the original was... Uh, it was sketchy. I kind of like cheesed it a little bit, but also barely made it with the Manra. Um, and having her die literally seconds after we triggered the uh, um, the cutscene. So it is what it is, but uh, hopefully this, uh, this goes some way to, to showcase 
um, a better showing for this particular mission. Thanks again for tuning in, folks, and I shall see you in the next video.